So sometimes I think about the strangest stuff. Like today, I'm looking in the mirror and I wonder to myself, you know, vampires, they're always so clean and tidy and good looking. How do they know they look good if they can't see in the mirror? Welcome back everybody to Tips for Women. And if you're new to the channel, uh, this is where we talk about everything in a man's mind that he doesn't want you to know. And today we're going to dive into the subject of should you make the first move on a guy? And this could mean so many different ways. It could mean you just met him or you're already together and you're thinking about making the move on some other things that you want to do. But today we're going to dive into the edge of it to where you are just now wanting to meet a guy. Either you see a guy across the room or you see a guy in the grocery store or you see a guy walking down the sidewalk. Should you make the first move into going after him or showing him that you actually are into him? So the answer is, and always will be, for 99% of guys in this world is hell yes. Guys absolutely adore that. For them not to have to worry about if they're going to get rejected, if they're going to look stupid in front of their friends, you know, all the things that you worry about as a woman. Well, guys have the same feelings. I know, ladies, that you think that all guys are supposed to act macho and, and, and we're all cocky and we're all just a bunch of, you know, know-it-alls. Well, that is not the truth. We look in the mirror just like you. We put our feet in our pants one leg at a time just like you. And guys have insecurities. Um, more than you would ever, ever know. It's just that guys don't usually very often talk about them with anybody. They can't tell their girl because they're supposed to be the man. And they can't tell their buddies or their co-workers because their buddies and their co-workers will laugh at them. So guys keep a lot of stuff inside when it comes to insecurities. But as always, I'm going to give you the truth and that's why I'm here to tell you that guys are way more insecure than you would ever think. And for you to come up to him and show him that you like him and that you want to speak to him or go out on a date with him or whatever reason that you're going after him, it ends all that insecurities that's built up within him. And now he feels like he's on top of the world. He feels that he is the most special thing on this planet, and you have made him feel that way. So should you make the first move? Well, hell yes, you should make the first move. And if you don't, well, then just sit over there by yourself, and hopefully he'll work enough nerve up to come talk to you, which I doubt it. Most guys that go and talk talks to women by themselves are usually uh, with their buddies or they're just drunk or they, lo they just lost all shame and they really don't care whether you say no or not. But most guys do and that's the reason you'll see a guy look at you and then look away, look at you back and then look away. So girls, come on. You know, the girls in this in this world that fought for their rights and wanted to be treated with respect, but it's a double-edged sword when it comes to y'all because you want all that, you want to be respected, you want to be adored, you want this, but you also want chivalry to still exist. You want guys to open up the doors for you. You want guys to make the first move for you. You want guys, 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 guys. Well, ladies, this is in the year of 2000s, so it's time to share the responsibility. If you like somebody, go after them. And if you don't, well then leave them alone and go after the guy that you really want. So I hope this was a good tip today, ladies. And you know, like always, 
stay beautiful.